Bowie Field is missing an important player. It's overwhelming. Ryan was just so amazing. And um, it's nice to see that he didn't just touch me and so many other people. 31-year-old Ryan Lee and his wife Ivanya were shot and killed by his mom's ex-boyfriend Monday in front of their two kids, according to police. Their son was also shot, but he survived. This is just a family that, beyond the tragedy of what happened, it's a tragic loss to the community because they were going to do the right things. They were well on their way to being huge contributors to the positive society. The latest was starting the Lee Academy last year, a nonprofit aimed at empowering kids through sports. Ryan loved football, and a lot of Elite Lee Academy came from his love for football, but at the end of the day, it's meant to make all of us better people. He wasn't just teaching football, he was teaching character. Ryan's cousin, Kylie Summers, says her family always said he was the best of them. So they and his friends were determined to make sure the Academy's first ever fundraiser still happened. Just trying to keep his vision alive. Honestly, the goal is to all of the money we raise here to put it in a pot for the uh, Lee Academy Foundation and in every event, every year, keep putting on a new event to just build and grow and, and keep this vision rolling. As the ball changes hands, they swap memories. He was a jokester, like, you know, he was fun going. Uh, he cared about community a lot. Ivanya, she was just a wonderful young lady. She really was the kind of people that we want as our neighbors, as our friends. As Calwood Summer's nephew. I'm gonna miss him. I think our family needed this today. We were all, we're all very proud of him. Ryan Lee's family tells us his 10 year old son, Junior, is still in the hospital recovering from multiple gunshot wounds and has a long road ahead of him. So prayers for him and his three year old sister are appreciated. In Bowie, Jess Arnold, WUSA 9.